Hi everyone, I am Sonia Chia from Sri Venkateshwara College of Engineering. Today I am here to explain about minimizing of a DFA. For the very first, let us see the introduction to DFA minimization. Minimization is the process of reducing the number of states in a deterministic finite automata. Minimization DFA helps in simplifying the automata, making it easier to understand and analyze. Minimization is achieved by merging states that have equivalent behavior. In the automata theory, DFA minimization is the task of transforming a given deterministic automata into an equivalent DFA that has minimum number of states. Here, two DFAs are called equivalent if they recognize the same regular language. Several they have several different algorithms accomplish the task are now described in the standard textbooks of automata theory. For each and every language, there also exists a minimum minimal automata that accepts it that is a DFA with a minimum number of states and DFA is unique. There are three class states that can be removed and merged from a virginal DFA without affecting languages. Unreachable states are the states that are not reachable from the initial state of DFA for any input string. This can be removed. Dead states are the states from which no final state is reachable. These, can states, these states can be removed unless the automata is required to be complete. Non-distinguishable states are those states that, be, that cannot be distinguished from one another from any input string. These states can be merged. Remove dead and unreachable states will accelerate the following step. Merge non-distinguishable states optional recreate and a single dead state if the resulting DFA is required to be complete. And, like, and the next let us see the equivalence of states. Two states in a DFA are equivalent if they have the same behavior remaining they accept the same set of in the strings. Equivalence is determined by the analyzing the transitions and accepting states of DFA. Equivalence classes are performed based on the behavior of the states. Now let us see the table filling algorithm. The table filling algorithm is a common method for used to minimize the DFA. It involves creating a table to track the equivalence of the states and their transition in a given DFA. The algorithm interactively fills the table until the states demand equivalent or non now let us see the steps which are involved to fill the table algorithm. The step one is mark all non-accepting states as non-equivalent. For very first we have to mark all the non-accepting states as which are non-equivalent. The next step is make all pairs of pairs of accepting and non-accepting states as non-equivalent. Step three is repeat the following steps until no further changes occur for each pair of states. P, Q that are non-marked as non-equivalent, non-equivalent check if all transitions from the P and Q lead to equivalent state. If it is marked, then mark it as S and if it is equivalent, then mark it as S. If it is not equivalent, just leave it the same. And the next is it is the example of DFA. Let us consider a DFA with five states that is Q1, Q2, Q3, Q4, and Q4 be the final state. The DFA has a transitions and accepting states. For very first, let us write the table filling algorithm. The step one is mark all non-accepting the step one is mark the directions of A and B which moves from one state to another state. And the next mark all non-accepting state has non-equivalent that is Q0, Q1, Q2. Q3 accepting state with Q4 will be marked separately because if Q4 is a final state. Now let us see the step two. Mark all pairs of accepting and non-accepting states as a non-equivalent. For example, Q4 is the final state, so we have to merge with the same Q4, Q0, Q4, Q1, Q4, Q2, Q4, Q3. And the next step, the step is compare the transitions from pairs that states that are not marked and is non-equivalent. If all transitions from P and Q or A and B lead to the equivalent states, mark A and B as equivalent. If not, it mark, it, you just leave it blank. Continue the process until no further changes occur. Until uh, in the sense until same DFA or the same transition should be occurred. And the next, this is the minimized DFA, and this is the last step when we use the 
minimize GFA after applying the table field algorithm, we can merge the equivalent states to obtain a minimized GFA. By, minim by merging the equivalent states, we get the final step of this uh, DFA that is called as minimized GFA. The minimized GFA will have favored states and equivalent behavior to the original DFA. When the above procedure work for DFS, the method of partition does not work for non-deterministic finite automata. There is an exhaustive search may minimize an NFA. There is no polynomial time algorithm to minimize the real general DFA. And the no general DFA will, however, there are, there are methods, there are methods of NFA nomination, DFA no minimization that may never, that may, that may never, Never get minimization. A DFA is a minimum if and only if all states are distinguishable. This means that no two states are equal valent or better. This DFA is a minimum if for every states of A and B we can find a distinguished ring. <clears throat> In an automata theory, in NFA minimization is not a task of transforming a non-deterministic finite automata, but in DFA it does transfer the finite deterministic automata. <clears throat> Let us try the minimization of the number of states of the following DFA as shown above in the figure. We should do every minimization is essential to determine the proper molecular arrangements in the space since the drawn chemical structures are not energetical favorable. Let us see the conclusion part. DFA minimization is a crucial step in simplifying and optimizing finite automata. The table filling algorithm is an effective model method for minimizing DFAs by reducing the number of states we can improve the efficiency and understandability of DFAs. Minimum number of states are required for DFA is 3, the, which deterministic finite automata accepts the language represented by the regular expression. Now let us, uh, like providing the every state which is both reachable and distinguishable, you must give a word that goes from first to an accepting state and from a second to a rejecting state. In the DFA that recognize L is a minimal, if M is a DFA with the minimum number of states in order for this to happen in A and B. The input of DFA is in the input of uh, minimizing is a DFA and the output is minimized DFA. Thank you for watching my video.